So many of the claims made by flat earthers can actually be debunked in less than two minutes. And we're going to look at one of those today. And I'm sure many of you have seen this. It's where they compare two images of the earth taken by NASA. And because the size of the USA looks quite different, the claim made by flat earthers is that the images must be faked. But I'm going to show you how easy it is to disprove this claim just using a normal globe. Here is an image of my globe looking at Australia. You can see that the globe almost fills the full width of the frame. And look at the apparent size of Australia. Now here is the same globe. And look at the difference in the apparent size of Australia. Again, the globe almost fits the full width of the frame. Look at the size of Australia. And let's go back to the first image. It's the same globe. Now, why does Australia appear so different in size if we're looking at the same globe? And the explanation is quite simple. In this image, I'm quite close to the globe and zoomed out on the camera. In this image, I am a lot further away from the globe and zoomed in. So you can see the globe takes up most of the frame and yet the apparent size of Australia is very different. And that is all we are seeing in the NASA image. Obviously those photos were taken from significantly different distances. Now I'll play a short video just proving that this is in fact the same globe. So now we are close to the globe and you can see the width is almost full frame. And look at the size of Australia. Now if we move away and then zoom in to make the globe fit the width of the frame again, you can see that Australia appears much smaller. Let's move close. Australia looks larger. Let's move away and zoom in. Australia looks smaller. So as you can see, another flat earth claim debunked in just two minutes. And that's one of my remote controlled helicopters. I've got several of them. That was one of my hobbies before I encountered flat earth. And before I finish this video, I just want to give a quick shout out to Bob the Science Guy because today I watched one of the most impressive Flat Earth debunking videos I have seen in two years. And it's called Flat Earth Can't Science 31, a Flat Earth model and map. Now Bob is a pilot, he's also a doctor, and clearly a very intelligent man. I strongly recommend you check out this video.